Welcome to the Nicholas 11 X12 technology. Today I'd like to compare the AMD A105800K APU with the Intel Core i3-3220 CPU. Both processors are really good and cost about the same at the time of this video. Unfortunately, I can't show you that many game benchmarks since I didn't have so many games back then when I tested the Core i3. Also, I'm sorry for not including any real comparison charts of the integrated graphics, because I almost didn't test the iGPU at this point. So yeah, you will mostly see benchmarks on the CPU part because of that. Now, let's get to the benchmarks. There you go, as you saw yourself, both processors are good. The Intel Core i3-3220 beats the AMD A105800K APU and let's say every single CPU power test. But the A105800K isn't far behind. When it comes to the integrated graphics, AMD's chip is a lot better. In fact, if you decide to go with the iGPU, then the A105800K definitely is the best choice you can make since every single game is playable at the time of this video. Of course you will not be able to max out the game settings, but you can surely go with good enough settings. The Intel Core i3's iGPU performance really lets you down, but then again you get better CPU performance. When comparing the CPU performance in games, well, both pretty much perform equally. In some CPU demanding games the A10 may fall back a bit, but not too much. Another important topic would be the power consumption. The Core i3-3220 has a low power consumption by far, while the consumption on the A10 APU is a lot higher. That's probably because of the powerful integrated graphics. AMD's chip uses the older 32nm process, while Intel's uses the new 22nm technology. So the lower the nanometer, the lower the power consumption. But overall, the power consumption of the A105800K can't be considered as bad at all for a 32 nanometer. Of course, it's higher than the i3, but you also have to keep in mind that you get powerful integrated graphics. So, in the end, it's your choice whether you go for the AMD A105800K or the Intel Core i3-3220 CPU. I really hope this video could help you, and maybe you've already made up a decision. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.